Peter Phillips with ABC News. The ICAC has heard yet another story of a Liberal MP being handed a wad of cash in an envelope. Liberal member for Newcastle Tim Owen says he took the money from the city's mayor, Jeff McCloy, but later gave it back. He's also told the state's corruption commission he knew his campaign was being partly bankrolled by developers. Nick Dole reports. Emerging from a full day of questioning, the member for Newcastle said he had more than a few regrets. Oh, I'm sad about it all and, you know, it's, yeah, it's a difficult situation and I'm very sad about it. Hi, my name is Air Commodore Tim Owen. A former military man, Mr Owen was considered a strong candidate. Shortly after being endorsed, he says he met with Jeff McCloy near this Newcastle shopping centre. What came next tested his conscience. He just handed over a thin envelope. What, no foreplay? asked counsel assisting. Mr Owen says he took Mr McCloy's cash, but about a day later he dumped it back in the developer's letterbox with a note saying no thanks. It's trying to buy influence, isn't it? Yeah, you could say that, but he's a pretty generous guy, Mr Owen said, before admitting it does look bad. Mr Owen also admitted knowing developers were contributing to his campaign, but he put the blame on his campaign manager, Hugh Thompson, and the man who became police minister, Mike Gallagher. He says he trusted them to look after fundraising legally. I was really told to keep my nose out of that. He claims they told him... We will manage the money. Some people might say it looks like willful blindness, though, Mr. Owen. No, 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 it's not that. Clearly, um, you know, inexperience has, has led me to be in a position as we all are at the moment, and I'm pretty upset about it. At one point, counsel assisting Geoffrey Watson became frustrated with Mr. Owen, saying he needed to shoulder at least some of the responsibility for the prohibited donations flowing to his campaign. Will you be staying in Parliament? Uh, I'll make some comment uh, after we finish tomorrow. The future of his Hunter counterpart, Andrew Cornwell, will also be discussed tomorrow in Parliament. The MPs already admitted taking tens of thousands from developers. I'll be moving a motion tomorrow that seeks to expel Mr Cornwell from the New South Wales Parliament. The real question is, will Mike Baird vote to clean up politics and see Andrew Cornwell expelled? One government source says it's simply a stunt. Nick Dole, ABC News. The chaos enveloping Iraq is...